from Nayland Stadium in Knoxville, Tennessee, the UCLA Bruins meet the Tennessee Volunteers. The Tennessee starting offensive unit across the front. Wide receiver Stanley Morgan. Inside at Satterfield, Cone, Johnson, Marvin, Higginbotham, and Tommy West, the tight end. It'll be Paul Carruthers. Nearest to you there, number 32, and number 21, Stanley Morgan, and Morgan is the one who can really fly. The man who will be kicking off for the UCLA Bruins is number 34. His name is Brett White. The ball is on the tee, and here is the first kick of the 1974 football season, and he dares it. He goes right to Morgan at the 8-yard line. Morgan is at the 20, the 22-yard line before the UCLA Bruins wearing the white shirt. Condridge Holloway at quarterback. They call him the artful Dodger down here. You know where that comes from. The wingback, number 81, Tom Fitzpatrick. Number nine, 43 is Mike Gales, the tailback, and the fullback is Dale Fair. UCLA with five men up front and the handoff goes inside to the fullback fair and he works it right and here comes something bob devaney the volunteers don't go for the huddle let's see if they try to go for the bomb holloway puts it high in the air got morgan going deep he's open he's got it he's in his way touchdown tennessee the old element of surprise for 74 yards and the ball's just quick just one of the finest plays in the opening series of a football game that you've seen in a long while. It was a great fake, and uh, Holloway dropped back. The pass was perfect. The try for the extra point. Hot Condridge Holloway holds it perfectly, and Townsend drills it through. The deep men for UCLA in white. Number 24 is Russell Charles, and number 30 is Eddie Ayers, and the kick is in the air. It's a low-line drive. It is fumbled. It is picked up by Charles. Charles has daylight at the 15. He is busted hard at the 20, and he's looking across the offensive front for the Bruins. The wide receiver split in. Norm Anderson, Dennis Big, Gene Clark, Randy Cross, Art Kuhn, Mike Horton, Phil McKinley, Gene Blaymeyer. That's the biggest offensive front you'll see anywhere in college football. The quarterback is number 15. He is John Shara. So here comes UCLA's first running play or first offensive play with Eddie Ayers, Wendell Tyler, and Wally Henry. Long count, Shara hands the ball off to the first man on the gear. The setbacks are 22, Tyler, and 30 airs. They go it up the middle again across the 25. Pass run from Holloway to Morgan. Third down and three. The play goes inside. Tennessee reacts very well. Andy Spider, number 50, the linebacker in there, forces the fumble, and Tennessee comes out of the stack with it. So UCLA coughs up the ball. Holloway is back in. Fair sets behind him. Number 33 in the fullback position. Holloway fumbles the ball, and his feet are knocked from under him. Ball is just inside the 30. Call it second down and nine yards to go for Tennessee. Holloway turns. Good pursuit from the right side. And number 63, Greg Norfleet at the 34-yard line. Third down and 14, and Holloway on the option. He is buried by white shirts on the 30-yard line. He's going to hit the football from the 37-yard line out of Holloway's hold. It is a 47-yard field goal try. It is no good. Close, but just sailed outside the upright. With 11.26 to go in the first quarter of play, John Shara is the quarterback with uh, Russell Charles. Number 24. Second down and six yards to go. Chara turns, fakes and keeps. He pitches the ball, and Tyler fumbles the ball. But Tyler is able to recover for a yard loss. Chara, behind Charles Block, gets to the sideline. He's up about the 30-yard line. Just outside the 30-yard line with Chara at quarterback. He turns and hands the ball to the first man. That's Wendell Tyler, number 22. They send Wally Henry, number eight, a speedster in motion. They hand the ball off to Zabie. Now they got power backs. Now they send Henry again in motion. Here's the pitch outside to Tyler. He does not get the first down. He is dropped at the 38-yard line. Uh, Morgan uh, back here is a real dangerous punt return man. That's a relatively short kick. You'll have to fair catch it. Now, as Georgia Tech under Pepper Rogers takes on Air Force Egan's Fighting Irish of Notre Dame, 9 Eastern time over most of these ABC stations. And the handoff for the running play over the left side. UCLA gave an average of a little better than 18 points a game. 
Gales and Fair are the setbacks behind Holloway. The handoff is to the fullback Fair. He's across the 36. Needs about a half a yard for the first down at their own 36, just outside it. Holloway keeps the ball, turns it inside. He's up to about the 44-yard line. First down for Tennessee at the 44-yard line. And Holloway back to throw. He looks for Morgan. Morgan was held up. Holloway is on the run. He's exciting when he goes on the run, but Tundridge Holloway on the field will be a sophomore from Oklahoma City. Number four, Pat Ryan. Randy Wallace figured to be the backup quarterback, but he's been injured. The handoff goes to the fullback. And a hard hit by Nanoski. It is third down and two for Tennessee at the UCLA 48. And back to throw is Ryan. And up to grab it is Tommy West, the tight end. 15-yard pass play gives Tennessee a first down at the UCLA 34-yard line. And the handoff goes to Gales, the tailback. And they're moving against the Bruins. Second, nine, second down and nine from the UCLA 33. Pat Ryan is the quarterback. Holloway's hurt out of the game. Ryan following his fullback fair. And the big guy from Oklahoma City moves it all right. Ryan coming down the line, gets rid of the ball, a nice play by the quarterback. He was in the grasp of a big UCLA Bruin. On fourth down for Tennessee, and five yards from the UCLA 29, Ricky Townsend is in for his second field goal try. He missed from 47 a while ago. He hits this one from the 37-yard line. Another 47-yard try, and this one's on the money. So he's hitting 500 from 47 yards, and that's a handy fellow to have around. So Tennessee leads it with 2.56 to go in the first quarter, 10 to nothing. All right, here's the kickoff by Ricky Townsend. He knocks it deep into the end zone. And Eddie Ayers is going to bring it out. Oh, look out. He's pulled a hamstring. You see him reach back for his leg. You know he pulled a muscle in his left leg, otherwise he might have broken that all the way. Hishara is in there at the quarterback position. Wally Henry comes in motion. Russell Charles and Wendell Tyler. Shara going to the sidelines, throws his pass. He was on the sidelines and was it good? As uh, Eddie Ayers looks on from the sidelines. UCLA first down, Tennessee 49 yard line. Play goes up the middle and you see that Tennessee line back in court. Wally Henry is little number eight. 5'8", 160 pounds, and they put him in motion again, and up goes the flag. Too much time. Charles still got it. Delivers it back to Charles, and Charles is not out of bounds. They've got to go to the Tennessee 39 to get a first down. Wendell Tyler in the backfield. Shara goes back to throw. Has a lot of time. He throws, and it's a fine catch by Henry, who came back to meet the ball. But in coming back to meet the ball, he sacrificed the yardage. Rep White, number 34. He hits the ball at the UCLA 46, trying to hang it. Stanley Morgan back there. Calls fair catch at the 11-yard line. And All right, you saw Condrick Holloway standing on the sidelines. Yeah. Pat Ryan, the sophomore, is in there at quarterback. With Gales and Fair behind him. He's going to throw it deep out of his own area, but he elects to run it. The big kid can move it, can he? He brings it up to about the 17-yard line. Pat Ryan from Oklahoma City in there on second down. And... The ball the and UCLA, UCLA has. has the ball. Well, UCLA should have it as we come to the end of the first quarter. Tennessee 10, UCLA nothing. Gene Settles, number 59 of UCLA, thought he had possession of the football, but the officials ruled against him, and Tennessee retains possession. So after an argument, Gene lost it, and he's back in defensive posture, and here come the balls on first down to the 21. And they're moving the football with good up-front blocking. Second down, a yard to go, from just outside the 30. Ryan turns inside, runs into Greg Norfleet, and goes down. Ryan is your quarterback. To others is number 32. He is a senior for the Volunteers. And Ryan never had a chance to unload the ball. And off four options. Go back to live action as Neil Clavo comes in. Average better than 43 yards a punt last year for Tennessee. Wally Henry receives the punt for UCLA. Youngster who give him a little bit of daylight and he can really send you, but the coverage is very good by Tennessee. As he sends Henry way wide to the right, and he's running this way. He gets his pass off intended for Wally Henry. Henry leaps for the ball. It is thrown out of bounds at the major college level. Shara turns. He's still got it. He pitches the ball back to 
Tyler and Wendell Tyler is across the 40 to about the 42 yard line. It's still at the 43 yard line. They're on 43. First down, Charles keeps the ball. Turns inside with this one, spins, fumbles the ball. Tennessee's got it. And the Volunteers have it at midfield. Shira had close to a first down. When so the Volunteers have it. First down at their own 48 yard line, leading 10 to nothing. Scored a touchdown in the first half minute. And they've got a 47-yard field goal from Ricky Townsend. Here's Fair, the fullback. Looks like he wanted to throw the football. And got with Morgan, the way wide man. Pat Ryan, the quarterback, on second down and four yards to go. Ryan pitches that ball back to Gales, his tailback. And Gales aims for the 40, and he gets there. UCLA in a three-deep defense this time. And the dive play. It is second down. And about seven yards to go for a first down at the UCLA 36. Ryan, Pat Ryan, getting pressure. The ball is loose. Bruins have a shot at it. But I think Tennessee was able to come back and get a hold of the ball. Tennessee leading 10-0 with 10.40 to go first half. Ryan hands the ball off to Gales. The tailback gets a good block at the line of scrimmage, and he goes down to the 39-yard line, the original line of scrimmage. Ole Miss and Tulane postponed because of Hurricane Carmen that's hammering that part of the country. Townsend in for a field goal try. He hits it from his 42-yard line, and it is way, way short, a 57-yard try. He has a 51-yard field goal in his record book. Number 32, Bobby Farrell, senior from Mona, California, in the UCLA backfield now, along with the Wendell Tyler, number 22. And Tyler has the ball, gets it locked, and he has felt it hard. Second down and six yards to go from the 24. John Shara, number 15, turns, keeps it, tries to turn inside. He does, and he takes it up to about the 28-yard line. It is third down and a yard to go. They've got to go to the 30 to get it. Shara gives it a second man, Tyler, and he runs over people as he takes it almost to the 35. Shara pitches that ball away to Wally Henry, the little speedster. Bigger crowd than they anticipated. UCLA, second down, eight yards to go. Shara puts it up, intended for Clay Meyer. And an effort and interception by Jim Watson. Well, Tennessee's loosened up its defense here. A lot of time. Runs out of time, runs over his own man. He's temporarily. Look from the end zone as Brett White hits it towards Stanley Morgan, the deep man for the Volunteers. He's going to run it. Oh, look out! Well, they get him at the 34-yard line. With Tennessee holding the ball. Down and 10 yards to go at their own 35-yard line. Pat Ryan is the quarterback, and he hands that ball off to Dale Fair, the fullback. And Fair takes it down to the UCLA 48-yard line, 17-yard game. Ryan comes down the line, gives the ball to Gales, his tailback, and Gales. The immediate area, forcing UCLA to feel a cornerback to watch him because he is so quick. Here goes Ryan to the air. He's got it up. He's got it too long. And third down at about six yards to go for Tennessee from the UCLA 44-yard line. He's going to put it up on third down. He throws short to Carruthers, and Carruthers gets quite a greeting. Here's the putt now on fourth and two for Tennessee. Penalty flags are down. And the UCLA is going to let it go. It's going to go out of bounds inside the 10-yard line. Hard on that punt. Tennessee was uh, here one of the leading punt punters in the country, averaging over 43 yards. Oh, look at that one. Did he ever hit one? He knocks it into the end zone. UCLA will have the football. And here we go, first down Bruins, and we've got movement all along the line. Once he's left his position, he can't get back. Wendell Tyler into the line. The ball is loose. He was popped. You could hear the collision all the way up here. The ball squirted out of there. Who's got it? Second down and 14 yards to go for the Bruins. Shara on a roll. Shara's going to throw it. Shara's got Anderson upfield. Makes a sliding catch at about the 30-yard line. First down, UCLA, 30-yard line. Shara's still got it. Pitches to Russell Charles, and Charles no place to go. And again, Spiva is there to make the stop. And UCLA is going to get nailed with another five-yard penalty for taking too much time. So it is second down and 18 yards to go. Shara rolls. He's looking downfield. He throws downfield, and the pass is caught by Norm Anderson. Yeah, he's in. And the right side of the UCLA line. Offsetting penalties. Okay. Third down and two from the 37. Shara 
Cuts inside, gets his first down, goes to the sideline, walks, slows him down, and Spiva brings him down. But a fine run. Two and a half minutes to go in the first half. Shara hands the ball off to the first man. Tyler and Russell Charles and Zabi are the setbacks for the Bruins. Charles 24, Zabi 26. Shara rolling to throw. Gets his pass off. It is caught by Blaymeyer inside the 20 yard line. Great catch by Blaymeyer. Ball is just inside the 20 yard line. First down, UCLA. Shara almost dropped the ball, tucks it in, and gets a couple of yards. Inside 50 seconds to go now. Second down and eight yards to go at the Tennessee 18 yard line. Charles pass to the sidelines, complete to Monahan. Monahan runs out of bounds on the 10 yard line. That stops the clock. They still have two times out left. UCLA's most serious penetration of the game. Charlotte tries to get to the sidelines, can't do it, takes one man, gets his first down, goes out of bounds, stops the clock with 35 seconds to play for from the seven yard line with 35 seconds to play. UCLA threatening for the first time in the game. Charlotte coming around, bumped by one of his own men. He pitches the ball back to Russell Charles, and Charles loses a yard back. And a sophomore, Pat Ryan, has the chore of quarterbacking Tennessee. Here's Charlotte back, gives the ball to Charles. No place, he gets a couple of yards. We've only got one wide receiver out. Charles going that way in the direction of the wide receiver. He's running for the corner. He's not going to get there. They do have time. He hit that fence very, very hard, and he is down. And Brett White will try for the field goal from the 10. It's a 20-yard kick. Bruins trying to get on the board with 11 seconds to play. Bad snap, but the kick is up, and the kick is good. So UCLA does get on the board in the first half. They couldn't get in for the six, but they take the three. They're Art White throws it away. And uh, Carruthers will take it. A yard deep in the end zone. He's got a very sore right leg. He brings the ball out to about the 16-yard line. Stadium here in Knoxville, providing us with its usual spectacular picture. And Pat Ryan does take the snap, kills the clock. The first half has a run out. An exciting first half of college football starting 1974 with the University of Tennessee Volunteers under Bill Battle holding a 10-3 lead over the UCLA Bruins and Dick Vermeil in his coaching debut. All right, let's see how the prayer books are going to be handled as Ricky Townsend hammers it. And it's going to go to Wally Henry. Nope, bounces the other way and goes to Russell Charles who comes outside the 20 to the 25 to the 27-yard line. It is Tyler and Charles. Charles, number 24, Tyler, number 22, the setbacks. And Shara keeps the football. Turns around the 30, goes to the 35, breaks out into the open. He's on a foot race. He's got help. He may go. All he needs is one block. He cuts back, and he's going to fall down at the two-yard line. Can you believe it? Watts. All right, back to live action. The handoff to Wendell Tyler. He tries to slant over the left side. His second down and goal to go. The ball is closer to the three-yard line. Here's the handoff to Wendell Tyler. And Tyler, his knee is down at the one-yard line. Just inside the one-yard line, we look right down the line of scrimmage. John Shara has his play, gives it to the second man. He fumbles the football. UCLA man, John Shara, I believe, dove on the ball. Look for a rollout type of play here. I believe they'll roll out one way or the other. There's the option. He, he did it. not make it. At the one-yard line. All right, Pat Ryan is now in at quarterback. Condridge Holloway is out of the Tennessee lineup because of a, a mild shoulder separation. Ryan throws the ball That's in the, the end zone. UCLA's got touchdown. a touchdown. Seven. Here's the try for the point. The ball game is tied. Now, uh, there was some speculation before as whether they would go for the two points, and I think they answered it very clearly there. Oh, we are locked even. 10-10 between UCLA and Tennessee. Along with number 21, Stanley Morgan. And here's White's kick. Scoots it on the ground. It's going to stay on the field of play, all right. Nope, went out just at the one-yard line. Look. And he's got to bring his team back here. All right, White gets it off. It is a short kick. It goes to Morgan out on the 11-yard line, and he is hit very hard and dropped. The fumble, the ball is loose. UCLA looks like they've got it, and the officials agree. The Bruins have the football. See what the Bruins can do with this golden opportunity. First down at the Tennessee 30-yard line. Shara turns, keeps it coming around. Two men blocking fast to give it away. The ball is fumble again, and Tennessee's got orange shirts all over it. There's two white shirts at the bottom. Let's see who comes up with the ball. 
Tennessee's got it. Gales and Fair are the setbacks for the Volunteers. Pat Ryan gives the ball off to number 33, Dale Fair. And Tennessee may be staring at a lot of games without Condridge Holloway. Ryan keeping on the option, turns inside, gets good yardage, goes up to the 40. Orange shirt leg back there. Penalty flags are gold or orange looking things, so it was not a penalty flag at all. Here's Ryan on a stutter. He's run down from behind as he... Morgan is wide to the right side on second and long. Ryan stands to throw, has all day. Looks, looks again, goes deep. Morgan is wide open for a moment, but now it's picked off by Kent Pierce. Morgan had gotten away from Pierce, but Kent dropped back and played the ball beautifully. Choo Choo Schumann is in the ball game in a running back position. Asara goes back to throw for UCLA, goes to the sidelines, has Anderson out there, overthrows him. As the Bruins come up and set with Shira handing the ball off to the first man. We're tied at 10 10, and the handoff goes to Russell Charles, number 24, and he squirts close to the 20 yard line. He with Henry on the right. Shara turns, makes to Schumann, keeps it, pitches the ball wide to Charles. Four Tennesseans after him, and they nail him. Shara back to throw, looks, goes the other way, got a man, Anderson, he's knocked down at the 34-yard line. Down, volunteer, 34-yard line. Score is tied at 10-10. Hand off to Charles, hitting right at the line of scrimmage, came from outside left. He read that play well. Here's Shara rolling, looks for Henry. Going to run it. Down to the 28-yard line. Move off, Emmanuel, he go on and on and on and on. He's going to throw. He's looking for Anderson. Goes to the short man, and it is incomplete. Intended for Wally Henry. They're going to go instead for three points. It's 45 yards. Field goal effort by Brett White. He had that range in the pregame drill, but he does not get that one. He had enough on the ball, but it slides off to the right, wide, and Tennessee holds, takes over for Tennessee to the attack now with Pat Ryan, the sophomore quarterback from Oklahoma City. Back to throw. Whips him to the sidelines. Morgan on a wide receiver screen. He's running up the middle of the field. He's breaking into the clear. And he has finally run down at the 40-yard line. To spring him into the secondary. First down, Tennessee, their own 40-yard line. We're even at 10. Here's Ryan holding the ball, turning inside, and the Bruins get him. It is second down and seven yards to go for Tennessee at their own 43. Ryan pops it up into the air and is dropped. Intended for his tight end, Tommy West. Third and long. Third down and seven from his 43. He's going to put it up. You heard the Bruins yell pass. He hits his man. He drilled him at the UCLA 46-yard line. Ryan turns, keeps the ball, catches the ball wide. Cliff Frazier, the defensive end, flowing with the play. Dale Fair gets wide, gets a good block. They put a good block on Frazier. Ryan options again. Rumble! Tennessee, I believe, recovered. I think one of the offensive linemen caught it on the fly. From the 35-yard line, Ryan straight back to pass. A lot of time. Now they get to the ball, ball, ball again. again. And UCLA's got the ball. They're not so lucky that time. Right, UCLA, first down. They're on 48. Charlotte hands the ball off to Charlie Schumann, the fullback, and he doesn't get much. Second down play. Goes into the middle on second down and eight. Johnny Shara has not had a bad day at all, has he? He's a tough little guy. The only quarterback in the country who returned punch last year. Throws a bullet. He's got his man. Blaymeyer, the tight end. Blaymeyer's quick. He's big. He's strong. He muscles for about five yards down to the 21-yard line. <laughs> Linebackers with Dawkins. They guessed wrong. Shara rolls, and he's run out of bounds. Charles with the setback. Send the wide to the right. Anderson over to the left side. And Tennessee. I, I'm hoping that they will. In fact, I've got a great confidence that uh, they're going to win this game. Charles going to the air. Throws. It is in and out of the hands of Playmeyer. So now it is fourth down. Here is the kick by Brett White from the 22-yard line. It is no good. A 32-yard try on the field goal for UCLA. And all kinds of things are happening. And Tennessee is able to hold UCLA and keep them from scoring. 
And the artful Dodger comes running into the stadium at the most propitious time. And let's see what the little guy from Huntsville, Alabama can do. On first down and 10 for Tennessee at the 20-yard line. The score is tied 10. He throws the ball. His arm is all right. He throws it to Morgan on that same hip screen play. He's out at the 33-yard line. We're even at 10-10 with the clock running down. The third quarter is about gone. He does not get the playoff. The third quarter has expired here at Naylor Stadium in Knoxville, Tennessee, and it's been a dandy. The score, Tennessee, 10. The UCLA Bruins, 10, and we've got 15 minutes to go. Convict Holloway is back in the ball game. He left in the middle of the first quarter with an injured shoulder. He gets away from one man. He pitches drive to his tailback, Gale. A big archery up there, Bob, is only a freshman, number 64. I've been watching him, and he's really played himself a fine football game. And this, this was one that just happened. Third down. Third down and seven yards to go for Tennessee from just outside the 35. Holloway's going to pump it up. Good. And there's that pop play from the volunteer 48-yard line. Take the fair. They throw it off to Morgan. It's a lateral pass. It looked to me like, nope, they call it an incomplete pass. And Keith, second down and 10 yards to go. 48-yard line, Tennessee. Double coverage again by UCLA. Give it a gale to tailback. Third down. And eight yards to go. It's Holloway. Reverses his field, gets away in the backfield. Now he's dropped on the 45-yard line, and he is run down. All right, it's fourth down and a kick coming up by Claybo, and he hangs it nicely, and a fair catch is called for the UCLA Bruins back at the 19-yard line. Is it at their own 19-yard line? First down. John Shaw has gone all the way, gives that ball off to Zidi, and he is out to the 30-yard line. He first down, UCLA. Shaw turns, hangs that ball off up the middle to Russell Charles, and Charles pounds through there. And second down, uh, the 37-yard line, excuse me, second down. Shara hands it off to Zabie. He keeps wiggling and squirming and gets it across the 40, and he's very close to a first down. Most impressive debut as the starting quarterback for UCLA. He hands that ball off to that left halfback, and he just runs that straight dive play ahead. Second down, six yards to go, UCLA. They're on 45. This time he hands the ball to Zabie. Art Kuhn is over the ball. Dara throws it. Good. Pass to Anderson. First down, UCLA. Okay, just inside the 40-yard line. Anderson's caught five passes for 64 yards. Threw it having first down. And the handoff. Shara faking very well. And ball is at the 39-yard line. 38-yard line. As Shara rolls out to the left side. Trying to get away. And he's shirt tail. Shara has the ball. Gonna throw. Does. Wide open. It's Wally Henry. He fumbles. He gets it back. On the 15-yard line. At the 15, Monaghan replaces Henry in a wide receiver position. Shara hands the ball off. Mark the tackle on the left side. Move before the snap. And Tennessee runs down the ball carry. Lots of boys right here where they jump the gun. One of the setbacks for UCLA. Tyler is the other. Charles pass into the end zone. Touchdown. Beautiful pass. What a great catch by Anderson. And so the UCLA Bruins start at the 19-yard line and take it down the field. And let's take another look at Anderson. Fourth try as UCLA gets the lead. And White makes it. A 17-10 ball game with six minutes and 29 seconds to play in the football game. White hit all of it that time. He drives Carruthers deep into the end zone, and there will be no run back of that one. So no question, he is their leader. And he turns, and he gives the football away to the running back slanting over the other, the left side. Taking a mighty long time to get the play off, but he does it. He gives the ball to Carruthers, and Paul takes it out to about the 29-yard line. And he may have juggled the ball. It may have even come loose. UCLA arguing that it was loose, but what's the men in the striped shirts? They'll tell us. The ball. UCLA with five men up front. And Holloway gets past the end. Turns it up to the 35-yard line. Here's Holloway back to throw. Rolling option on the first down play. He gets the ball away to 
The man coming out of the backfield. All right, his first down, Tennessee. As the balls are trying to come back. The pair and Gills behind. Holloway still has the ball. And number 69, Big Frank. Holloway. Throws. Pass incomplete. Thrown behind. Bartolo are both in there in the defensive right end. This big Bob Crawford on third down. And nine yards to go. Holloway. He has daylight, but he throws the ball. And it is complete for Morgan. He's down on the 13-yard line. The 12-yard line. And Morgan came off the field under his own power. Waffling some, but he made it. Holloway on a roll to the right. He has blocking. He's got his head down and headed for six. He's in there. effort by Holloway there, that last minute effort where he went over the top of uh, a blocker and two tackers into the end zone. It was just a real fine play. In kicking posture, Holloway is the holder. He could do it, but they knock it through and they go for the one, and you've got a tie ball game at 17-17 with three minutes, 11 seconds to play in the ball game. He, uh, UCLA is not playing for the onside kick, and he goes deep. It goes to Charles a yard deep in the end zone. The wedge is not effective. He gets back to the 19-yard line. He's ABC stations at 9 Eastern time for Notre Dame and Georgia Tech. John Shara, he'll keep this one. He's got room on the sidelines, and he runs it out past the 30-yard line. Williams is in, replacing Hank Walker in the Tennessee linebacking core. Shara hands the ball off to Charlie Schumann. There is no room. Shara. He's up, he gets across that 40, and he goes almost to the 45-yard line. We're taking it down to the last gap, 2.13 to go. Opening game of the season. Penalty flag is on the field. It follows our telecast from Knoxville, Tennessee, and of course, Monday night. First down and 15 now for UCLA at their 38-yard line, and Charles sets to throw. He's uncovered. He is in serious trouble as Pullum runs him down, but he unloads the ball, got it off to Wally Henry. Just one. Remember, they had to spin one early. Chara turns off the corner and cuts back into the middle. And he's down at the Tennessee, 46-yard line. Pass to the sideline. This complete to Henry. Now with 43 seconds to play. It's second down and three yards to go. As Chara goes to the sidelines again. And the pass is caught by Anderson for a first down. All right, Henry to the left, Anderson to the right. Here's Shara rolling, the clock in motion again, gets away from one man, gets away from two, he's got to get rid of the ball, he's given up a lot of territory, he throws it down the sidelines and it is incomplete. But the referee must have ruled that uh, he really was just throwing it away. It's a tough call. It also is loss of down. 17-17 tie, and what a way to start a college football season. Shara stands, he throws, it is incomplete. There's a pass in the holding yard line as Tennessee held the intended receiver Anderson. All right, his first down UCLA at the Tennessee 43 yard line. Shara back to throw. Has time. Gets it off over the middle to play higher. He's got it down at the 23 yard line. It's another UCLA first down. And they come from the hash mark. I'll let you watch it from the end zone. He missed it. Saw the ball hook a little and go wide left. And so Brett White misses a 40-yard field goal try that might have won the ball game for Rich Holloway at quarterback. And nine seconds remaining to play in the football game. Holloway on a bad ankle, hobbling around, a sore arm. He throws. The pass is completed to number 81, Tom Fitzpatrick, the Provincial College School Board. And Monday night at 9 Eastern time from Atlanta, Georgia. The ball game is over here in Knoxville. And we have a 17-17 tie between UCLA and Tennessee. And Monday night at 9 Eastern time over most of these ABC stations, we'll watch Notre Dame and Georgia Tech tee it up. And that one should be just as good as this one. And I don't recall ever seeing a better opening football game. Bob Devaney, it had everything in the world in it. It had bad luck. It had good luck. It had excitement. It had great plays. It had bad plays. It had its heroes. It had its goats. We'll be right back.